AWS community builder. So I have been an AWS community builder since one year now. And today in the morning, I got a mail that I have been selected as an AWS community builder for second year. And apart from the amazing swags, there are so many benefits you get in this program, like meeting and connecting with awesome people, $500 credits to use in AWS, learning AWS and other DevOps tools for free, free exam voucher and so much more. So in this video, we are going to discuss how you can apply and become an AWS community builder, what are different benefits of becoming an AWS community builder and some tips on how you can become one. So let's get started. AWS Community Builder program has personally helped me so much in growing as a DevOps engineer and as a person who uses AWS every day. Due to this program, I have been able to meet and connect with so many amazing people and I will not lie but the most important benefit of this is the $500 credit you get. So due to this credits, I haven't paid a single penny for my AWS bill since one year or more than one year. I'm going to show you my credits in the later part of the video. So there are awesome benefits that you get as an AWS community builder and you get to learn and grow in your career. So I personally think everyone should apply and become an AWS community builder. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can apply for it, what are different benefits and what are some tips you can use to get selected in your first attempt. So before we go ahead and apply for it, let's just understand what is AWS community builder program all about. To explain you this in simple words, AWS Community Builder Program is a special program by Amazon Web Services, obviously, to recognize and support people who are expert in using AWS services and also passionate about sharing their knowledge and experiences with people who might be new or who want to learn AWS services. So if you are a community builder, you get a chance to connect, learn from each other and share their skills and expertise. AWS organizes various events and community days where these members can come and speak on different AWS technologies, share their knowledge and they also get a chance to network with each other which can lead to new career opportunities and collaboration. And personally, I have got few clients for my freelancing projects through these events as well. So overall, AWS Community Builder program is a great way for people who are passionate about learning and sharing their knowledge on AWS services. Now that you have an idea of what is AWS Community Builder program, let's learn how you can apply for this program. To apply for the AWS Community Builder, all you need to do is search for the AWS Community Builder form in your browser. And once you search for it, you need to click on the first link which says AWS Community Builders Worldwide Cloud Community. So once you click on this, you will get an option something similar to this for now if the form is not open. So if the form is not open, you need to add your name to the waitlist so that when the form for the AWS Community Builder program is out, you will get a notification something like this where it says you have requested to be alerted via email when the Community Builder application form was once again opened to new applications, new applicants. And when, it is, when you get this mail, you can just go ahead and open the form and start filling it. For now, it is closed. So let's say the form is open and how would you fill it? So this is how you would fill it. So when, you, when the form is open, you will get a button saying apply to be an AWS Community Builder. And in this form, you need to fill in some details. So first you need to choose your category and you need to choose your category based on your background or the work do you do. For example, I was someone who was using DevOps tools. So I selected Dev tools. If you're someone in security, you can choose that and you can choose more than one category. So you don't need to worry about if that aligns in your category or not. Uh, next is you need to share your story. You need to tell AWS why do you want to become an AWS community builder? How will you becoming an AWS community builder can help the community? How are you going to share your knowledge? How has AWS helped you as well? So you need to enter your story, make, try to make it big, brief and try, don't try to use ChatGPT or anything. Make sure you have your own feelings or your own words so that uh, they can review and accept you. Next, next, you need to share your social media profiles. So if you are someone who is creating reels on Instagram, you can share your Instagram profile here. If you're someone who is posting content on LinkedIn, you can put your LinkedIn profile here. If you're someone who is creating AWS videos on YouTube, you can put your YouTube channel here. So any social media profile that you are using or sharing your knowledge on, you can put it here. So Twitter, LinkedIn, Instagram, Facebook, anything. Next, you need to share the links to blogs, videos, events, projects, or anything that you have shared on your social media profiles and that is owned by you. So you can put a link for your blog that you might have posted on Medium, on Hashnode. You can put a link for the project that you might have uploaded on GitHub. You can put a link for your video that is on YouTube. So try to put more than two links. The minimum is two links. After you put this, you need to fill out the survey, which is about how 
you have used AWS and how you, how you can contribute to the community if you become an AWS community builder. So after you fill this, they will review your form and uh, if you have been selected, you will get a notification or a mail, something like this, uh, that you have been selected as an AWS community builder. And don't, don't worry if you haven't been selected at the first attempt because you can again apply. Even I was not selected in the first year. So don't worry and keep on applying because there are a lot of applicants that apply and the reviewers have to select some of them. So you need to stand out and post more content about AWS and try to share your knowledge. Now that we know how to apply for this program, let's discover some of the benefits that you can get if you become an AWS community builder. The first benefit is to network with amazing people. If you become an AWS community builder, you are given access to amazing Slack community where you can connect with different AWS experts. You can ask questions about AWS. You can also collaborate with them and you can get mentorship as well. So this is the first benefit where you can network with different AWS experts. The second benefit is the subscription of Cloud Academy. So if you become an AWS community builder, you get one year free subscription to Cloud Academy where you can learn so many different technologies. You can learn about AWS. You can prepare for your AWS certifications and not just AWS. You can also learn different tools like Ansible, Terraform, Kubernetes, anything. I think this is one of the best benefits that you can get. Personally, I have been using Cloud Academy for so long. And now that I've been selected as a community builder for second year, I'll continue learning from Cloud Academy subscription. Third benefit is the $500 credit. So as a community builder, you can get $500 credit to work on AWS, to experiment and to create projects on AWS. Let me show you my credits. So I am here in my AWS billing dashboard. And if I show you my credits right now, I have one credit which is given by AWS community builder program. So I got $500 credit out of which I've used 292 and I still have 207. To addition to this, I'm going to get $500 more because I've been selected for the community builder program second year. So due to this credits, I haven't paid single bill. If I show you my bills for the month of April, I have used around, uh, I've used around $26, but didn't paid anything. So I haven't paid anything for month of Feb. I've used around, uh, $15, but didn't paid anything for month of January. I have used around $27, but didn't paid anything. So. This is the benefit you get when you become an AWS community builder out of $500. You can use all different services and you won't be charged because you have credits. In addition to this, you also get some amazing swags by AWS. So I got this water bottle by AWS, uh, cap uh, by AWS. Also this very cool adapter by AWS. You can see the name here and also some more things which you can check out in this video where I have unboxed my all swags by AWS. Also, you get a free exam voucher that you can use to get AWS certified. If you're selected as an AWS community builder for second year, you get all these different benefits. Now, let me give you some tips on how you can get selected as an AWS community builder in your first attempt. If you want to get selected, make sure you share your knowledge on social media profiles and include those links in the form. Along with this, you also need to engage in the community. So start attending meetups and events organized by AWS and share your knowledge and connect with people there. Not only this, you should also mention your certification. So if you have any AWS certifications, let it be cloud practitioner or solutions architect associate, developer associate, anything, make sure you mention that in your form. You can share your knowledge on various profiles or platforms like LinkedIn, YouTube, Instagram. Not only this, you can also share it on Stack Overflow, Reddit and include that link in your form. Make sure that the links you share are public and can be seen by the reviewer so that they can review your contributions and select you as an AWS community builder. If by any chance you're not selected, don't be discouraged because you can apply for AWS community builder twice in one year. So if you're not selected, apply it again with new things that you have shared. And once you're selected, make sure you continue sharing your knowledge with the community. So there you have it video on what is AWS community builder, how you can apply for AWS community builder and my tips to become an AWS community builder. I hope this was informative. If you have any questions, feel free to write it down in the comment section. You can also contact me on LinkedIn. Thank you and have a good day.